Hello guys, my friend asked me to restore this decade old PC. So I connected it to power plugs and monitor tried to switch on and try my luck, but it didn't work. He said the main purpose of buying that PC was to play the games, right? Slow down over a period of time and he used it as a normal machine for some time. And recently it stopped working. Let's see what is inside. Oh my god, I could see a lot of dust. Hope this dust did not damage anything. Yeah, this is more dust than I expected. And you can see a 1 TB HDD. That is good. And oh my, all dust around and connected to DVD drive. It seems SMPS is a good one. And I used a vacuum cleaner and dusted it off. That is the first thing that I did. See how it looks now. So I can read the details, I can see the labels. Yeah, it's nicely sitting on the Foxconn motherboard. And yeah, this looks very neat right now. Even if you are a beginner, there are four methods to restore your PC. Check if this SMPS is working or not. That is the first thing that you can try. Even I tried the same thing. Second thing is replacing this 3 volt battery. As it is pretty old system, this battery might have dried up. So I changed that battery. Even it didn't help. You can see that 3 volt battery. I think you can read that label. New Sun 3 volts. Yeah. And the other thing I tried is dusting off the RAMs. So it was sitting on a 4GB RAM. Now I installed another 4GB and dusted off both of them. It worked. So this is the third thing that you can try if your system is not switching on or if you want to restore it your system. The fourth thing is reapplying the thermal paste by removing this CPU cooler. You can remove, you have to remove this CPU cooler and apply a thermal paste between bottom of this cooler and on top of the CPU. I'm going to leave links in the description below on how to do or how to handle these four steps. As I told you, when I dusted off RAM, it worked and it switched on. I could see it is running on AMD Phenom X2560 processor and it is sitting on Foxconn A88 GMLK motherboard and it is having 4 GB of DDR3 RAM. I also wanted to speed up a bit while it is booting. So I bought this SSD from Edata which is of 240 GB. I am going to use it as a booting drive. You can see. I also bought this RAM because this motherboard supports the 8GB RAM and existing one is having a 4GB so I bought an additional 4GB to speed it up. This is from Hynix DDR3 4GB RAM.
and I install the RAM in the slots you can see I installed it in the first slot new one Hynix one and another one the whoop and the old one I installed it in the second slot and this is the SSD I installed I could see this SMPS is having two power cables to connect drives one is connected to existing 1 TB hard drive and another one is connected to DVD drive but I checked with my friend he never used the DVD drive so I removed it and I connected it to the SSD to avoid falling it on the motherboard or the cooling fan I am just fixing the SSD Existing hard drive was shaking, then I fixed it as well. I'm just reassuring everything is all right. RAMs are installed, SSD is fixed as well as HDD, cooling fan is fine, everything is connected. Now I am trying to switch it on, yeah it switched on and it booted in 25 seconds. Given the age of the system I felt it is awesome to boot it in 25 seconds. You can see 8 GB RAM over there and I also installed Windows 10 on the SSD AMD Phenom X2560 processor of 3.30 GHz I connected online and looked for Windows update. So Windows will look for the updates and update them. They are going to update in few minutes. You can see all of them started updating. Now let's see how this can handle a simple game. I downloaded it from the Microsoft Play Store or App Store. Yeah, graphics are nice. So when you are restoring your PC guys, you can always do these two things. One is check how much capacity your motherboard can handle. You can upgrade RAM accordingly. Other thing is add a SSD and use it as a booting drive so that it definitely improves the speed. Yeah, let's see how I am going to handle this game. I think I am playing okay. I think I'm going to make it, yeah. Good luck with your system, guys.